In this video, we'll learn to read numbers up to 200. I've written down the numbers from 1 to 100 in this square and from 101 to 200 in this square. I'll read these out to you. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Up to this point, you should be able to do these already at this level. Now, moving on, we've got 21. So, just one on top, there is 20 in front that we've just done. We add in one on top, 21. 22. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. 101. Just like the one here, we add an 100 on top, 101. 102, 103, 104, 105. 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, 113, 114, 115, 116, 117, 118, 119, 120, 121, 122, 123, 124, 125, 126, 127, 128, 129, 130, 131, 132, 133, 134, 135, 136, 137, 138, 139, 140, 141, 142, 143, 144, 145, 146, 147, 148, 149, 150. 151, 152, 153, 154, 155, 156, 157, 158, 159, 160, 161, 162, 163, 164, 165, 166, 167, 168, 169, 170. 171, 172, 173, 174, 175, 176, 177, 178, 179, 180, 181, 182, 183, 184, 185, 186, 187, 188, 189, 190. 191, 192, 193, 194, 195, 196, 197, 198, 199, 200. So I've counted all the numbers up to 200. What did you notice? From when I read these numbers and the ones after 20. 
So again, the units are repeating themselves. That one is appearing here and again. So 1, 11, 21, 31, 41, 51, 61, 71, 81, 91. So every time, it means you've got 20 and an extra one, 30 and an extra one, 40 and an extra one, and so on. Same thing over here. We've got 2, 12, 22, 32, 42. So it's the two extra the two units so if you've got 12 pounds is a 10 pound note and two pound coins 22 pounds it would be 20 pounds and the two uh, pound coins so that is appearing again and again so if you know how to read numbers up to 20 you are okay to read all of these other numbers so as long as you know 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90 and 100. It's the same pattern repeating itself. Then moving on, on to numbers over 100. We can see that, again, all that we have on top is 100. So 1, 101, 2, 102, 3, 103, 11, 111. 12 and 12 and that is being repeated all the time so if i want to represent 111 how does that look like in practice what does that mean it means 100 so i've got a block of 100 cubes in here and 11 so then a block of 10 and one single cube so 100 10 and 1 makes 111 so that one represents this block this one in the middle represents this block of 10 and the last one represents the single cube so 112 is going to be 110 and the 2, 113, 110 and the 3, so 113 looks like this. Now, if you look at, for example, 134, how is that going to look like? So 100, we have that 100 there. Do I have 30? I actually have just 10, so I'm going to need, that makes 20, it makes 30. And is that a four? No, it's three. So I'm going to need another single cube. And I do the same thing. Let's say 154 is going to be 100. I've got 30. I need another two blocks of 10. So there we have 40. And we have... 50 so 150 so in 154 i've got 150 and 4 up to the point where we have 200 so how do we represent 200 i could count on these so i'd make 10 blocks of these and no single cubes but the easiest way would have would be to have another block of a hundred so there I have a hundred and this one makes 200 so I don't need any tens so and no single cubes as well so that will be 200 and this is how to read numbers up to 200